One final word. Thank you all very, very sincerely for sharing this important event in the history of Orange County with us. We're glad that you're here with us. We hope that you'll join us again many times in the future. We hope that we will be able to join you in your home with some of the programs that we present over Channel 50. Thank you for coming and welcome to the tour. Hello there. I'm Pearl. Oh, Pearl. I have to tell people. Can, you, can we see you? Pearl, come on up here a little closer. I'm not going to tell your age, Pearl. Come on up here. Come on up here, Pearl. Uh, Pearl Martufi. Yes. Uh, she is uh, a grandmother. How many times are you a grandmother, Pearl? You'll tell us that, won't you? I, I think 11 times only. I, I should tell our, our audience that the way I became involved with you, what a delightful okay, person. Okay, you can tell me. You're, you're going to let me tell 70 your age? Yes, I'm 75. Made, what made you become involved in taking our telecourse, our television course, where you sit in your living room and you're going uh, to go to college? Yes, I heard it announced. And I had signed uh, for 16 units in this semester. And I thought, well, three more won't hurt if I can take it by television. So I, three more gives me 19 units this semester. 19 units, and we'll make up three of them on Yes, and this is three of them. One I have question. 16 at the college and three with you. We have a, a man that's very important in the life of uh, Disneyland, and his name is Jack Lindquist, Director of Marketing, Vice President. And come on up, Jack. Jim, nice how to are you? See. It's a pleasure to be here. Uh, Jack, uh, how do you feel about this new station for Orange County? Well, I think that... Uh, those of us with Disney, like everybody else in Orange County, are very thrilled, very happy to have uh, a station here in the county. It's been a long time. We need it. We want it. And we welcome you. Now we have some more people who are coming up to have a visit with us. Jim, shake hands with Harry Dalton, general manager of the California Angels. What's the name Angels? of that ball club? I think yeah, it's, that's, <laughs> they call it the Angels. Yeah, they do. Harry Dalton, uh, can you tell us a little bit about your experience of coming to this Orange County, a, a place that you were a little unfamiliar with many years ago, and what you think about this place? Well, Jim, we've been out now about uh, 13 or 14 months, I guess. We came in October 71, and we're delighted. Uh, from a personal standpoint, living here in Orange County, and from a professional standpoint also, it's, uh, we were saying the other day uh, with the family, we were having some little outing together in the county, and we said we don't know what it could ever be that would take us back east. Matt? Could I, could I trade with you? I, I've always wanted to hold a lion. If I, yes, you took my microphone, can I take the I lion? I always want to be an acondition. Let me have the paperwork. Okay. Can you have that? You now, let's hold that microphone right between us here really close. Right. I'm holding a lion. You see, I told you to have this lion. Now, you know where he's from? Lion Country Safari. Uh, certainly, uh, when we talk about uh, Channel 50s caring about all the institutions that make up the lifestyle of Orange County, we think of uh, a very new one for our institutions, and that is Lion Country Safari. Can you tell us uh, how you feel about this new station opening first, Pat? Well, I'm pleased to see it here, and I understand this is the first station in Orange County. Yes. And I'm pleased to see you here because I've seen you before and worked with you a bit. Okay, thank you, Jim, for having us up. Pat Quinn, Zoological Director of Lion Country Safari. Thank you, Pat. Another institution of, uh, certainly another institution of Orange County is Knott's Berry Farm and my very good friend Dean Davis. Good evening, here. Jim. Good to see you. What do you think about this, uh, hey, th this having the tube down here in Orange County? This is just like being uptown, Jim, only better. I made a tour of your facilities and they're just ideal. you got everything going here for you. We have a little token here for you, uh, oh. just to help you, a little good luck charm. A this good is luck charm. Mickle. I wonder if, the, uh, if we can get a look at that. It's the a uh, good luck charm. A wooden nickel from Knott's Berry Farm for KOC. Con contrary to what your great-grandmother might have told you about never taking one, it does have yeah. value, because with the wooden nickel and 30 cents, you can get a ride on the cable car at Knott's Berry Farm. How oh, great. And without it, it's 25 cents. Uh, Claire Trevor, what a delightful lady. Hello. Claire, how about a hand for Claire Trevor? Hello. Isn't that nice? Uh, I should tell our listeners that uh, Miss Trevor has been... Mrs. Milton Brand has been extremely interested in what this station is all about, which is community service. I know that you're interested in now the Arthritis Foundation, and in, I know the many things you've done for the March of Dimes. Do you want to tell us what... Well, I care about both of those uh, organizations very much and uh, try to do everything I can to help them. I've uh, lived in Orange County now for 16 years, and I consider it a real privilege. To you live know, here. I consider it a privilege to be standing next to you. You look lovely. Today. I'm so happy to be able to be here and wish you all the luck in the world. And I think it's going to be a fantastic 
added addition to uh, our community. Jim, I think it's very exciting that one, you've done as much as you have. I didn't know that you had progressed to this point where you, you're already operating, but the facilities are, are really tremendous. In fact, a lot better than a lot of the independent stations that I've worked for in the past. And I think also the response from the community. I did something not too long ago in New Hall, yes. and they did not get the response that you're getting tonight, especially with young people. It's always a delight to see so many young people out here.